with another ROM review which is Rise Droid for Redmi 7 and very latest and this is the first time we have Rise Droid and nowadays this is a really really hyped custom ROM which is very very customizable and tons of customizations are available and I will talk about everything so don't skip the video watch till the end now let me show you from the settings and first of all the user interface of settings is really really different and you people can change that settings user interface now let me show you about phone and this is the ui of about phone then we have the raspberry devices and other things and the wallpaper which you will use uh, in your home screen that would be show, shown here and of course first build and unofficial of course no problem with that and android version android version 12l and raspberry version 3.5 rise and kernel used here the lineage os and which is really really great and lineage os kernel is always capable which is really battery smooth experience can brought to you now we have here system and language and input this is vanilla build i'm using here and of course gf's link will be in description just use that one to get better performance and gesture system profiles every single customizations available in that room if you are a uh, customization lover and you love customization in custom roms then this is for you and here we have the rise red lab and other things allow application downgrade and ignore windows secure flags whatever you can read yourself and use then updater and other things and gesture of course we have the customization here like system navigation can be customizable and left and right edge be length and back gesture and other things and one handed mode everything working pretty much fine no issues and no issues with battery life then we have the google account safety and emergency privacy security and lock screen now let's talk about that what we have in the section and here we have the face unlock and fingerprint and we have application security that means the app lock you guys can use and you guys can also set the custom time uh, after unlocking one application and you can set the time for five seconds ten seconds and then it will be locked automatically so that's great thing let me show you here is that and auto lock timeout this is called 5 10 30 1 minute 5 you guys can set that custom time then of course we have all the customization here and here we have that one the utilities that means accessibilities you guys already know about that feature then we have the sound and vibration section the ui is really a bit different from other custom room and do not disturb ringtone one ringtone two for sim one and two everything can be selected and adaptive sound which increase your sound quality which perfectly working and other uh, regular things are available you know, what we have in other custom rooms so all these are uh, same things and charging sounds so this is cool thing and when you just uh, plug in and plug out you will get a great sound quality uh, which is great then we have the storage and battery life battery life is great no problem with that i didn't find any problem then we have notification apps and wallpaper and style just talk about that we have some uh, built-in custom uh, wallpaper so which is really cool looks you guys can easily use no problem and we have a grid option and dark theme themed icons app grid huge collection no issues with that then we have the display and brightness and now let's talk about the customization the user interface is really really different and video will be long for this section so i will talk about everything about us if you want to read that you can do that and button section of course like as other custom room we have all the customization in button section and lock the screen as well and i don't want to waste time by showing this things and double tap to sleep fingerprint vibration ripple effect you guys already know about that 
Uh, let's talk about the miscellaneous unlock high fps in games like other uh, voltage os and other custom room we have the game space and high fps unlocked in game and unlimited photos storage so i think that's the important things to show to all of you guys so this is going to be a great thing with lineage os kernel you guys will be able to play games in high fps so no problem And here is the navigation section, pixel animation, IMA button space, IME button space. That means if you don't want the uh, button space on uh, your keyboard, under the keyboard, then you guys can uh, just disable that feature. Show arrows, arrow keys while typing and invert layout and other things. All these are actions. We have notification, reticker and other things, sets up, less boring and other things, battery light, everything is just fine, notification and quick settings, of all the customizations and battery styles, so many styles are there, dotted and other things, usable, no issues and position, brightness slider, position top bottom, like other custom room you guys can see like an animation style so flip and flip y whatever you guys can select no issues huge customizations are available just let me scroll and watch so many things are there and then we have the sound section pulse volume steps and other things and status bar all the customizations and logos and i'm using here on the top left corner here is the logo which is from uh, that rice droid and the styles huge kind of styles are there then we have the network traffic indicator and which is working fine and location can be selected and other things really cool and then we have the old style and signal icons and other things or voltage or wi-fi or and other things uh, color icons whatever you need and battery styles so many battery styles are there really really great thing and battery bar customization and quick pull down smart pull down everything is there and then user interface every different ambient display and can be selected other things and settings background style settings uh, home page style settings style i'm using right now this one and you guys can select any of those and monitor setting monitor engine setting you guys already know about that then we have the font style i am already selecting the nothing os font that means yeah nothing dot one plus so many fonts icon packs signal icon packs and everything are available you guys already know about that and i don't want to waste time uh, we're showing all these things now let's talk about some basic things the smoothness and the other things and no lag and stutter in the section of control center no lag and stutter it's really 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 just part of a smooth experience and when you scroll down everything is really great and now let's talk about the app opening and closing animation and which is also faster because uh, Linejo's kernel is used here so Linejo is always capable and is stable so then we have the settings that means the launcher where we have another system great thing which is icon pack you guys can select icon pack by default you guys will get that default icons and sims icon pack and if you want to use any custom icon pack then just uh, go to plus section and download any icon pack according to your choice then use which is really great icon size font size and everything can be customizable and home screen lock layout and status bar and top shadows and other things uh, which is great and app drawer customizable everything and the latest thing is available here like uh, grid option which is great and so many tabs are open it still is working fine and on the top uh, on the bottom you guys can be able to see the uh, extended memory or other memory left you guys can ram used everything every information is there and that can be seen on the bottom and let me show you that on the bottom here is the thing 1.1 gb custom app uh, available which is from 3 gb so that's great thing and now let's talk about the things like 
CP throttling and which is 79% and which is great I think because if you keep using the ROM for some days you will get so much better performance. Then let's talk about the Geekbench score and which is really better than other uh, nowadays we have the custom ROMs under 12L uh, better than those custom ROMs and then of course safety net is passed by default here you guys can see safety net passed by default so no issues with using banking application so that's great things and we have here the other every single customizations and use a tons of customization i could not show you right now here so but i think i uh, can manage everything to show you so if i miss anything then just let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching